Back again. Measurement. Metric units of volume. So we're in the metric system. Learned about metric units of length last module. And now we're talking about volume. And so how do we measure volume? Liters. So length. We have meters. Um, metric units. Length is measured in meters. Volume is measured in liters. All right. So. Uh, have you ever been to the grocery store and you bought a two liter or three liter bottle of soda? Yeah, probably. Um, that's measured in liters. All right. So almost identical, I mean, not almost, just identically to meters, liters, and then next we're going to learn about grams. Um, the metric system is so consistent. Again, I tell you, I told you last time, it, it's just a game with, uh, it's a game with place value, right? So one liter, it's one liter, right? If you have 10 liters, you add a place value, it's, it's now a decaliter. How many years are in a decade? 10. Decaliter, 10 liters, that's cool. If you have 100 liters, hectoliter. If you have a 1,000 liters, that's a kiloliter, kiloliter. It's pretty cool. And then again, a tenth of a liter is a deciliter. A hundredth of a liter is a centiliter. And then a thousandth is a milliliter. That's cool. I mean, so when you when you think about milliliters, uh, you think about maybe medicine. When you're a kid and you, you took the cough medicine, it's measured in milliliters. It's small measurement. So again, uh, each of these is just separated by one place value. All you have to do is move the decimal. And you either get bigger or smaller. It's awesome. The metric system, again, is just based on uh, place value, ones and zeros, and moving the decimal. So one liter is 10 deciliters. One liter is 100 centiliters, right? 100 cents in a dollar. should remember that. One liter is 1,000 milliliters. And again, it's the same number as one deciliter is 10 centiliters. One deciliter is 100 milliliters. One centiliter is 10 milliliters. Milliliter, again, the milli, milli, milli is the smallest unit of measurement that is going to be used in the metric system and definitely the smallest that you're going to use this year as a fifth grader. Uh, showing you the exact same numbers from the length, right? From, from meters or liters, all you're doing is changing the, the name at the end, okay? So we're gonna talk about the metric system a lot this module, and, and we're gonna get into, into these deci, centi, milli, but not today. Just wanna show you how these connect with place value, okay? And how the meters is just the same as the liters, just the same as the grams, it's just, it's just names. So a liter, we're gonna just talk about what does a liter look like? A liter loosely-ish, right? It's like a bottle of water. If you drink a bottle of water, that's a liter. It equals 1.5 quarts. So check this out. This is a quart of water, right? It's a quart of water. Uh, ah, anyway, a liter, okay? This is a liter. One liter is 2.11, 2.11 pints. Okay, or it's 4.16 cups. If you think, what, a, what is a cup of water? Um, a cup is eight ounces, right? So it's four cups of water. A liter is about a quarter, right? 0.26. It's about a quarter of a gallon. So that's like a quart. Okay. This is cool. A milliliter. A milliliter, the smallest measurement. You guys know those droppers? A milliliter is 20 drops of water. That's it. A milliliter is 20 drops of water, and a kiloliter, so a thousand liters, a kiloliter is 264 gallons. All right? This is this is cool. We buy as a as a world economy, oil is sold in 50 gallon drums. Those barrels are 50 gallons. And that is about 200 liters. Right? So 189, 190 liters. So just to, to try to reference and try to understand what a liter looks like and what it, what it, would, what it would be. Again, one, ten, hundred thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, 
It's just adding place values. One milliliter. So 10 milliliters is a centiliter. 100. 1,000 milliliters is a liter. Check this out. 1,000 liters is a kiloliter. Uh, it's, it's, it repeats itself. It is re really cool. The metric system makes so much sense once you learn it. Okay. That's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you have any questions about the leader uh, system, the metric system, as it uh, measures volume or capacity. And remember, volume is how much will fill in, how much of something will go inside of a form, right? How much does it take to fill something? So that's volume or capacity. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time.